Hey guys, welcome back to a new video. It's Croak, and today we're going to be going over a full customization and review of the Albany Cavaclade XL. So before we get in the video, please smash that subscribe button, like the video, and let's get into it. Alrighty, so we're going to buy the vehicle right now. So we're going to go to Little Internet and Southern San Andreas Super Autos right there. And it's the first one right here, $1,665,000. So we're going to click that, get it in the blue, and we're going to buy it. So we bought it right there, and then we'll fully customize it and review once we get it from our garage. Alrighty, so we're getting in the car right now, and first impressions here is this thing is huge, a lot of windows, and it looks pretty darn good. So essentially, this car is going to be based off the 2023 Cadillac Escalade V. So we're gonna go to the nearest shop and we're gonna get this car fully tuned up and customized for you guys. Alrighty, so we're at LS Customs right here and we're gonna give you guys the full customization and review of this vehicle. And so far, it looks amazing and we're just gonna repair the vehicle right there. So we know Irish covers. So this is something we haven't seen really on vehicles that I've customized. So that is how it looks right there. We're gonna go the carbon covers right there two thousand dollars and we're gonna do the full armor upgrade which is a hefty fifty thousand dollars we're gonna go down and get the race brakes let's take a look at the bumpers here so these are all the different type of front bumpers that we have for the vehicle so nothing really crazy to write home about but i do like the little lights on there i have not really seen anything like that so i'm glad rockstar is putting in more customization for this actual vehicle and from for more vehicles from now on hopefully so if you enjoyed the video so far smash that like button and comment down below if you have the car already and make sure you subscribe for all the daily gta 6 car customizations basically anything gta related so let's go to the engine right here we're going to do ems upgrade level four and we're going to go to the exhaust we're going to see each and every single one so it saves you time from what to pick when you actually wanna buy this car. So <laughs> we're gonna get the triple chrome exhaust, something I haven't seen before on each side. And front fender, we're gonna go and get the carbon. So hopefully you can deck this car out in full carbon, but it looks sick, guys. It looks absolutely insane right now. And we're gonna do the carbon front fenders right there. And let's go into the grill. I'm gonna go down a lot of customization for this vehicle. Absolutely insane. And I really love that. I just can't wait for GTA 6. So I don't know if I'm gonna go with that secondary. Well, it's secondary. So whatever you pick for the car, it'll change the color, hopefully, because I don't wanna have that baby blue. So I'm gonna go through all the hoods right here. We have selection, a lot of carbon fiber going on to this car, it seems like, which I don't really mind. So we're gonna have, I don't know if I can do that to this car. Let's see the carbon twin vented hood it looks amazing on it. Let's go down the lights, headlights, gotta get the xenon, and it looks good already. Let's go neon, front, back, and sides, and we'll go black light just to keep a casual, clean look. So I'm really interested in seeing the livery on this. Hopefully it's something good and drastically positive about this car is that you could put a nice livery on it. And wow, that looks insane. There's that would look great with chameleon. I think I'm gonna have to do that. Uh, multicolored camo looks absolutely sick, guys. Smash that like button for that. That looks sick right there. That's gonna look great with the chameleon. And we're gonna go down for the mirrors here, and we're gonna get the carbon mirrors. And boom, let's get that respray going. Now let's go chameleon. So this is going to look amazing here. So the dark purple, I mean, it looks good I have to say I think I'm gonna go with the dark purple it really blends in everything and it gives it that great look so I'll go to let's go to secondary right here chameleon and we're gonna go down to the dark purple right there so that looks sick right there I have never seen a car look like that and look at that grill right there that dark purple really does show and let's go back and let's go roof accessories so we have uh the roof rails so this has been a casual thing for suvs you can get some roof racks you can get the little uh roof box so i just want to have it like a nice clean look maybe uh the chrome sports rack will go with that there we don't want to sell that but we're going to go down to the skirts and these nothing to write home about from what i see right now 
So I'm gonna keep going down, and that is essentially all of them. So a lot of more, a lot of carbon on this vehicle, and it looks good already. So we're gonna go the chrome right here. You can do plastic if you desire. Spoiler. So this is very interesting. <laughs> I cannot believe you're gonna put a spoil on there. I'm not gonna do that suspension. Put it all the way low, 4,400 transmission. Let's soup this thing up. Look at that acceleration, guys. Absolutely insane on this vehicle. And we're gonna slap a turbo. That acceleration is all the way up, guys. I cannot believe this car right now. now let's go to chrome rims there. It's gotta make it look good. So let's put these bad boys, a carbonic Z on there. Can't go wrong with that. And let's go tires, tire design, custom tires, tire enhancements, 25K, and tire smoke. Let's go with a, I'm gonna have to go with a green. Where is the green at here? Green, stop that on there. And let's go windows, gotta go with the limo. And that is essentially it for customization, guys. Look at that vehicle, I cannot believe it. It looks amazing. So this car, first of all, looks amazing right there. What do you guys think? Comment down below. And let's take a look on the inside here. So look at that detail on that. The interior of this car just basically right there. It looks, that looks crazy. I just can't believe video games have come a long way. Nothing to write home about, about the inside. Just a casual dash. So that is essentially it for our little uh, look around there. So let's try this bad boy out. So the acceleration is insane on this vehicle. It's when you step on the gas, you definitely do feel it. So going back and forth, I mean, a little bit of sway, but nothing crazy. This car just came out. So I am going to give it a great score. There's no Croak Scar score yet, but I'm gonna have to say if you have the cash, and you're looking for a vehicle to have all your friends in, maybe do a mission or a heist, something to get you there. I'm saying this is a go-to. It's a big vehicle. It sits so many people inside, and it's a tank. Let's try to ram a car and see. Not the greatest. The crash deformation is decently good on it. So the Crow Scar, I'm gonna have to give it a pass on that. So comment down below. Are you going to get this car? I enjoy it right now, it's a fast vehicle. Let's see the top speed on this vehicle right here. I'm gonna try to do it on this little straightaway, see what we can get this car up to. Oh, we're, uh, we're spinning out, we're spinning out. Let's try to get this car up all the way and see what we can get it to. So we're stepping on the gas right here. So the acceleration, absolutely insane on a big vehicle like this. Haven't seen something like that. The swaying could, could be a little bit different and I'm just crashed. I cannot drive this car in uh, first person there. So let's try this again one last time, get on the highway, accelerate as fast as we can without trying to get NPCs hit. So we're at 100 right here, and let's see if we can get it to 120. All right, so we're zeroing in on that top speed right here, so we're gonna try not to crash. So we're over 125 miles per hour. Absolutely insane there. So we're gonna say it's 123 miles per hour. So definitely get this car. Uh, it passes the croak test and make sure you smash the subscribe button like the video and I'm croak and I'm out